Welcome, welcome. <laughs> there you go. I bring you this uh, this trophy, Nick. With my compliments. You're very welcome. Uh, that's a sampling of, I guess, what's going to happen to you a lot. Have you been well received so far in the United States? Yeah, very much, very would, much. Very would you good. please introduce me to your friends, please? Let's start with the gentleman on the far end, the saxophone player. Yeah, that's Philip Neville Smith. Philip, nice to have you here. Next to him. And uh, Graham Blythe Jones. Thank you very much. Philip, I'm sorry. It's nice to see you. On, on uh, drums back here. Uh, Blair Cunningham. Blair, nice to have you with us. Do we get a good shot of him? All right, on bass. Uh, Leslie Names. Leslie, welcome. Thank you. And lastly. And Mark Fox. Hello, Mark. It's nice to have you here. With the exception of Blair, whom I know you found in England, he is one of our countrymen. Did you all grow up in the same neighborhood? So, sort of, yeah, Beckenham. Where is that, for the benefit of those of us who live in this country not really familiar with your country? Um, well, it's sort of Kent, Kent countryside. That would help. Has anybody else in the music world ever come from that area? Um, no one except Bowie, I think. Bowie came from there. You've you got to be a very big hero, or heroes, I should say, over there now. Well, in Beckingham, yeah. <laughs> very big in Beckingham, yes. You know, you're going to be big all over the world, and I realize it's happening in Europe and England now, and it's happening right now. Will this change your style of life at all? Uh, well, we're going to eat more Smarties. More Smarties? Yeah. More chocolate. All right. Now, now I want to ask, who was the school teacher here that, that quit? Um... Uh, why did you do that? Well, uh, how can you resist? If people start screaming and things, you just can't possibly keep doing your day job, can you? <laughs> did, did you work both? You worked, uh, you taught and you did this? Uh, for the beginning, I was um, teaching during the daytime and playing concerts with uh, Hiccup 100 in the evenings. And then one thing had to go, and I just couldn't let this pass. So. I, wouldn't, I wouldn't think so. This has got to be a little more invigorating. That, that song you just played, Nick, you wrote all the songs in the album. What have been your musical influences? Um... I don't think they're musical, really. I think they just stem from, you know, sort of teenage things, really. Do, do these gentlemen inspire you at all, or do they just stare at <laughs> yeah, you in everybody amazement? Is, everybody inspires each other in the band, sort of thing. So We've got different influences, anything from Righteous Brothers, you know, Brazilian percussion music, jazz. 